very humid again for today, Danielle. We won't see much relief from the humidity until the end of the week. So the kind of warm and muggy conditions persisting here for both the daytime today and tomorrow. And then another Friday, be two in a row where it's kind of cool and dreary. Looking at the radar this morning, just a couple of isolated showers popping up and moving across Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts. Nothing severe this morning. And keep an eye on the radar for you. I don't expect to see a repeat of what happened yesterday morning where we saw some of that uh, flooding rainfall. But there is an isolated thunderstorm uh, passing near Albany, New York, and this one contains some heavy downpours that will stay to our north, but kind of a sign of things to come here as we move throughout the uh, daytime today with that threat of a shower or storm had a couple of sprinkles pass across Coventry earlier this morning. So kind of a low end. Uh, pinpoint weather alert day, more of a heads up than anything else. I wouldn't cancel plans today or tomorrow, but keep in mind, especially as you travel further inland, Providence northward, you could see a couple of stronger thunderstorms uh, during the afternoon and evening. In between, we'll see some partial sunshine and those temperatures will climb. Our threat tracker is low on Friday, but uh, not going to be a very pretty day here in uh, Rhode Island or southeastern Massachusetts. Little sliver of light showing up in Narragansett ahead of our sunrise. We look at our beach conditions today and uh, going to be a day where you'll see a mix of clouds and sunshine. Pretty sky in Providence, 71 degrees. Winds are calm. Humidity is high. We've been on the lookout for a little bit of fog. Just a touch of it down in westerly, 73 degrees. They are 70 in New Bedford, 71 in Providence. Dew points almost matching those air temperatures. That's why that relative humidity is nearly 100 percent. The air is pretty saturated here and we've got a front that we're watching up to our north. It's south of this front where the focus of showers and storms will be today in a couple of passing showers and clouds this morning and a mix of clouds and sunshine in the afternoon. Notice most of the activity early on in the day stays up to our north and then it tries to shift south and eastward through the later afternoon and evening. Heading into the overnight tonight, a lot of that quiets down. So tomorrow morning, starting off with clouds and some fog, giving way to partial sunshine. Another warm, humid day with the afternoon being the focus of most of the showers and thunderstorms, even into a Friday. Different scenario than what we'll have today and tomorrow. We'll have an east and northeast wind keeping cool, damp ocean air trapped in our lower levels of the atmosphere, and that will create a dreary day for us. Commuting into work this morning, isolated shower. Again, the temperature is going to be warm. We hit 86 yesterday. We'll be similar today away from the coastline, upper 70s to near 80 at the shore. Keep an eye on the sky in northern Rhode Island. You'll be in the mid to even possibly upper 80s in spots. 84 in Fall River, low 80s in New Bedford. Moderate rip current risk at our beaches today. So another thing to keep an eye out for. Uh, listen to the lifeguards. Make sure you're swimming with a buddy. On the bay, one to three miles visibility in any patchy fog this morning. Otherwise, keeping an eye out for a shower or thunderstorm. Wave heights today, one to two feet. Humid night ahead. Temperatures stay close to 70 degrees. Here's how that seven day future cast looks. So tomorrow, pretty much a repeat of today. Partly sunny skies, chance of a shower or a thunderstorm. Friday, of that uh, east and northeast wind keeping our temperatures very cool. It'll be dreary with some off and on showers and mist with the temperatures barely budging throughout the daytime, getting up into the upper 60s to lower 70s. We get back on track over the weekend, most of the weekend looking dry. Slight chance we hang on to a shower for Saturday, otherwise Sunday looking sunny with a high of 84.